yes yes welcome back to another video guys today is going to be pre and post stretching routines if you were like me back in the day you guys probably just walked into the gym started your workout without any preparation leaving you feeling a little off when you start those heavy sets on any exercise so this video is for you guys to learn how to build yourself up in the workout and how to wind down so let's get into it as you know before any workout it has to be dynamic it has to be something that warms up the body something that frees up those joints so that you can have a proper lift so dynamic it is That completes dynamic stretching. I always like to have my dynamic stretching outside on the track if I can, but if I can't, stationary is perfectly fine. There's no reason for you or excuse for you not to get moving and touch on every single part of your body, regardless if it's upper body day, lower body day, core day, whatever. It's important to make sure that nothing feels stiff or out of place or something doesn't feel right. Before we get into the post-workout stretching, little montage of my workout. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the bag for about 10 minutes now. And uh, yeah, I was heavy cardio. dive into the stretches I'll just put the names on the screens they did last time out and then we'll close out So, as you can see, most of my stretches, well, are universal and anybody can do it. It just depends on your range of motion for the moment. It improves over time and you shouldn't be discouraged because you don't have a lot of flexibility at the beginning. I did yoga for a couple of years beforehand. I haven't been doing yoga lately, but I still practice these movements because they are very representative of the flexibility aspect of yoga. Obviously yoga encompasses the mind, the body, the soul, and it also encompasses uh, stability and there is some strength aspects to it for sure. So again, this isn't an advocation for yoga, but it certainly is a reminder that everything is tied in together. So you should utilize everything as need be. Again, prioritize everything from the start of your workout to the end. That could be your dynamic stretching, your mobility, your actual resistance training, your cardio, and also your post-workout stretching. So again, guys, if this was helpful, please drop a like and subscribe if you haven't already. If not, 
you don't like this video, just drop a comment. We can, we can go into comment wars. <laughs> just fuck with you guys. I'll see you guys in the next one.